Oddball, do you copy? Oddball? Oddball. Where am I? Help, I'm trapped in TVs. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> Greetings, Earthlings. It's Shane with the Oddball Cards. It's Sunday. That means it's time for some coffee, some war talk, some shenanigans. I've gotten some blowback for telling new people that they should find something else to do. Let me tell you why. Because you don't have a David Pert in your life. You don't have a craggy bear. You don't get to mess with uh, my good buddy, Gradeworthy. Shout out to Lisa Z. This is some foreshadowing in our war. And so many of my friends, including Farm League, are super duper upset that... Uh, Murphy is not in the hall. I'd have to do my homework on his stats. All right. This episode has been a long time coming because it embodies two of my favorite people in the hobby. Uh, my good friend. Uh, sorry, Kurt. I bumped the camera, knocked the card. Get your laughs out. So this, uh, this channel kind of does its own thing. We hit go. We talk about stuff. Oh, my gosh. Uh, the second of my favorite people is Jeremy, who owns uh, and runs Baseball Card Warehouse. Uh, usually, I'm way too much of a control freak to uh, let someone else do a mystery pack thing. But Jeremy is a top-notch guy. He's a collector himself from way back. A fair, honest dude. And the second part is honoring my good friend Lance... It's something old, something new, uh, sports. So look at these packs. All right, we're going to dive right in because we have a lot to talk about this week. This episode is brought to you by Chris and Denise and their three magic means. We're going to save this till last because Oddball is a bit of a cheapskate and doesn't usually get this. So to honor the cheapskatedness, why don't we start with something I'm going to order another box of, the 75th Anniversary Chrome 2021 where your top rookies are Ryan Mountcastle, uh, Cabrian Hayes, and then it goes down from there, Andrew Vaughn, etc., etc. All right, DJ LeMayhew, you can go hang out here with our good friend Grade Worthy's favorite player. Here's a legend, Gary Carter, Whitey Ford, and a Danny Mendick. All right, so that's our Chrome pack. That's fun. This is a hobby pack of 2021 Series 2. And I love 2021. There's so many guys. Dylan Carlson's all uh, just people of that caliber. He can't even get playing time. Those Cardinals just crank out outfielders. I'm talking all the way back to our good guy, Randy Arazarena. Jeez, this pack is killing me here. All right. I almost bent a card. Goodness gracious, this is not for fun. Everyone should point and laugh because I'm on the struggle bus. All right, so yes, Chris and Denise have three magic beans. Uh, I've always wanted three magic beans, but when I was eight, you guys have probably heard this. I promised my sister one of my three wishes. Uh, Luis Alexander Basare, miscellaneous rookie. Uh, Garrett Crochet. Just some more foreshadowing. Uh, Alejandro Kirk. He is turning out to be one of the best folks in that class. Uh, really like that kid. All right. Nothing else of note. I'm a little too close to the camera. There we go. Do some calisthenics. Jared Olivo, miscellaneous rookie. All right. Nothing of note in there. So... That is a binding contract from when you're eight, I have found out. Oh, look at this. This is awesome. I haven't seen this yet this year. This is a big league 2023 pack. It's funny they did away with, um, I was never a big fan of opening day. Tyler O'Neill, speaking of those wonderful cards, outfielders, Blake Snell, Sterling Marte. I said Sterling. I meant Starling. Hey, look at that. Some more foreshadowing. We love Acuna on this channel. Knock on wood. And we have a rainbow foil <laughs> of Dansby Swanson. If you knew this channel, hopefully you left a long time ago. But if you did not, I sports hate, to borrow Bill Simmons' term, Dansby Swanson. 
And now he's a cub. We're going to put him up there because this is mockery from the baseball gods to oddball. Nick Castellanos. Hopefully he turns it around uh, for those Phillies. Fun pack. All right. Also brought to you by Lewis S's Glacier Tours. He uh, has spent probably 117 hours making an ice sculpture of Wander Franco, whose war, by the way, is 1.5. You can roughly... Add, these are before last year. Each free agent was paid about $6.8 million per war. So already in this short amount of time, Wander is 1.5 better than a replacement player. Jose Ramirez, Sonny Gray, Yohan Duran. Yay, Max Kepler. I like these. I think they're fun. Who did we get? Bo Bichette Williams. I'll take it. Some... Oddball fan favorites, as my good friend Clint pointed out in a previous video. Jonah Bride, miscellaneous rookie, and Paven Smith, Jake Cronenworth, I still believe. Brian Severn? Servin? I don't know. Some guy named Shohei. Yvonne Herrera, miscellaneous rookie. Seth Brown, Buddy Kennedy, Stephen Kwan. My fantasy guy, but also uh, one of my picks to click. All right. So Lance, with something old, something new. Ooh, I love this. 2022 Chrome Hobby. Goodness gracious. What a lot of value in here. I wasn't expecting the supplies. Love Jeremy. Love Baseball Card Warehouse. They've been through me from the start of my noobness in 2019. Through that uh, desolate stretch, they were doing some live card sales. Here's one of, another one of my favorites, Tristan McKenzie. And we did get a rookie, not a star rookie, but Alexander Wells. All right. I don't know how I stumbled onto Lance's channel, but he opens Ginter with his daughter. He collects the three big sports plus WNBA, and he just has a lot of fun. He collects what he likes. He's a big Cooper Cup fan. So this is sort of an homage to him. He always has variety and uh, interesting cards. These are beautiful cards. Uh, Jazz Chisholm is a center fielder now. O'Neal Cruz has a broken ankle. There's a red Clayton Kershaw who hit 200 wins. Look at this. Not who we want, but out of 25, Austin Hayes. We'll take it. Sorry, grade with your years. Oh, there's my guy. The 1.5 war in only a couple months. Love me some wander. Uh, red parallel of Kevin Gausman. It's so funny. I was going to mention him because when he was a giant or had a couple good years, I was like, who is this guy and why did they pay him so much? There's an Alec Manoa velocity. Just something else I'm wrong about. Speaking of things I'm wrong about, Shaka's Card Closet is our first uh, Q&A Sunday. That's what we do. He said, the Chicago White Sox are 7-20. and 20. You picked them to win the division. You've been talking up their guys. You can go poop in your shoe, oddball. There's a Dylan Carlson rookie. Here is a Miggy. Shout out to Lisa Z and all the other Tiger fans. Uh, Shaka, you are not wrong. Glaber Torres, shout out to Grade Worthy. It's your day. A futurist of Francisco Alvarez. A Brett Beatty, beautiful chrome prospect. Jackson Rutledge, chrome prospect. Riley Green, no comments. Can't comment on him because I don't want to jinx him. Here's an Isaiah Green. And our only first moment, it looks like, is an Aaron Sabato paper. We'll take it. What great variety in these packs. Quality. I'll take it all day. All right. So, yes, Shaka. Uh, I hope I have not jinxed your White Sox. This is an ugly, non-symmetrical pile that I have to fix. Uh, you'd think with Lance Lynn, Michael Kopech, uh, Dylan Cease alone, uh, but Luis Robert got benched yesterday for not running hard. That makes me very sad. I love that guy. I may be the cause of his jinxing. All right. You're right, Shaka, and uh, you do whatever you need to with my shoes. I feel terrible. 7-20 and 20 as of Saturday. I think they lost again. But uh, what are you going to do? All right. I love Eloy. I love uh, Andrew Vaughn. Oh, these cards are not in order. 
Here's an umpire. That's what you open baseball cards for. Hey, speaking of Eloy, that's my guy. Shout out to my good friend, Craggy Bear. There's another Sandberg. Eloy, I've gotten this pack before because that's my one of my fantasy pitchers, Aaron Nola. The cut chin back on the Pirates. The Pirates are have a winning record. I have to eat some crow. I am off and wrong. Dang it, I always think that's Dustin Pedroia and I'm happy. It is a Ginter back sale. All right. Put you up there with David Pert and Will Clark. That's kind of cool. International Trading Card Day. That's only fitting when we're honoring our good friend Jeremy, too. All right, two more packs. Uh, our next question comes from Clint at Swing Away Sports Cards. I call him the sheriff. He said, didn't I see you in Criterium Racer karaoke the Night Rangers? Don't tell me you love me. I said, you know, Clint, you can still rock in America. And uh, as the new Extreme song says, are you talking to me? You got something to say? All right, buddy. That's our segue into the war for you because you love the war. You love the Easter Bunny. Here's Sean Gunther. What would you get for one point? We know the top guys, Cole and Otani. After that, it's Matt Chapman at 2.0 war. Here's Edward Cabrera. Got to see him pitch last night. I've always liked him, which means his arm is going to fall off soon. Tony Romero, miscellaneous rookie. Corey Seager. Helio Ramos. That's only fitting when we're talking about Clint, so we're going to put it up here. Hopefully a good prospect for Clint's Giants. All right. Our last pack, really high quality pack. So at 1.8 war, there's some likely, uh, if you follow baseball, a little more than casually. Luis, and I, I realize I'm saying his name wrong, but I don't know how to say it right. Arias, who came over from the Twins, who's hitting like 442, is a 1.8 war. Sonny Gray, shout out to John Klinsman and the many, many Sonny Gray fans out there. Uh, you could also get Graham Ashcroft for 1.8 war. Then we go down to 1.7, my guy, Acuna. 1.6, War, Xander. And Cody B, that's why he's out here. I had written him off. All right, this is a high-quality pack, so we're going to give it our attention. Bryson Stott. Alec Thomas, I do like that we're getting rookies here. Jaron Duran, three out of four rookies. Four out of five rookies. And a Corbin Burns. These top's finest are beautiful. Jeremy is beautiful. Craggy Bear is beautiful. And our spotlight on Lance is beautiful. As always, very few hedgehogs were harmed in the filming of this video. Toodles. Testing 1 to 11, Banana the Hobbyist.